Craft Overnight. PetsOvernight.com. Deliver little bundles of love in a box directly to your door. All right, you are listening to Chatterbox, hosted by me, Laszlo, because I got kicked off the rock station. Let's go over here and talk to somebody about their life. Hello, caller, you're on the air. Hi, Leslie. My name's Martha. I love your show. I always listen to you when I'm getting my calling irrigated. I just wanted to say something about you. And, you know, the information for highway, the World Wide Web, and the Internet. Yeah, I've been on the yeah, I know all about it. <laughs> Isn't it amazing? I think it's incredible. I know a lot of people say it's absolutely a load of crap, but how can it be so dumb? It's remarkable, I think. Think of all the things you can do. I mean, the tools you want to buy in the UK. What I go to a shop, and the name's Laszlo. I'm so Leslie. I'm a regular listener. Well, I don't. I buy things online, and then I listen to music in a different format, like this is it while I'm dying. Incredible. I also like chef and cooking and reality, so the internet is really good for my hobby. I think it's amazing. I used to go out a lot, but I don't have to go out ever again. It's incredible. I don't envy those kids with their stock options or their fast cars. They earn them. The internet has saved my life. Wow. This is really going nowhere. Do you have anything interesting to say at all? Well, um, well, I once created the Declaration of Independence. That's f- You want the- <laughs> You're on Chatterbox. Hello? Uh, is that Laszlo? Uh, yes. Oh, wow, I'm on the radio. How exciting. Oh, thank you, Laszlo. Um, is this on the radio? I mean, am I actually on the radio for a second? Uh, uh, yes, you are. Uh, I'm sure it's very exciting for you, but uh, what do you want to talk about? Um... talking about? I, I, I'm married. Uh, one of those convenience jobs to protect you, I bet. I know what you're most like. You know more about men than... Chatterbox, where well, your opinion matters, or at least we say that. Let's go over here to line four. Hello, caller, what's your name? Hello, Jeff, what's up? I want to tell you and your listeners about a once-in-a-lifetime chance well, to make a difference. There's a rally for you to get the car. Starting at step, although we'll be paying... Get that guy! We got a steady and west car. We're going to march on the town hall. Last of all, the people have spoken. They have said, no, not in my town. So folks, if you're listening and want to make a difference, get yourself down to the park, prepared to bring democracy oh. back to the people. So, what's his rally about, Jeff? It's about people standing up and being counted. It's about the future. It's about telling those morons to the future. Don't they? Not in my town. Not while I have a breath in my body and hope in my soul. I will not, I cannot let this pass. Let what pass? It's about grabbing the town by the ball and saying, listen, son. Time to put up or shut up. No more Mr. Nice Guy. No more TV. Solutions to difficult problems. It's about what it means to be an American. It's about giving something back. Giving what back, Jeff? Hope, dream, belief. Belief in what? I mean, look, Jeff, I, I admire your passion. Really, I do. But what will people be marching for? What, what's your rally about? It's about justice, Mr. Malone. A chance to shine and make a difference. About thousands of people walking side by side in front of the march. Only one thing on their mind. A chance to make a difference. Bring your friends. Nothing shows a man how much he and more than a chance to walk together for justice. Bring your kids. They can paint signs, leave them a big cleaner, and a vegan bar. Bring your parents. Who the elderly care about tomorrow? I understand that. It sounds like a great rally, but we're not a political station, and you haven't really told us why people should do this. What is it about? Look, look, you want to help or not? I don't know what I'm helping. You're helping America. What kind of patriot are you? 
It's a rally. You don't know what it's for. Prancing around in leggings, shouting, Hiya! Okay, that though, I'm warning you this time. turn black and fall off. Give it a quick prod. Oh, what is that gooey yellow stuff? Oh, hey, Pave! My handyman. I, I was bored, so I came over to keep a suka company. 
She's got the makings of a natural, this girl. She's managed to extract this little gem from our guest. There's a plane coming in to Francis International in two hours' time. It is full of Catalina's poison. You can avoid airport security by getting a boat out to the runway light buoys and shooting the plane down on its approach. Collect the cargo from the debris and stash it. Oh, you be careful now, okay, baby? Now try the chili oil. Here at 24. Glad will be sold the eternal. But let me answer the question. When I'm in trouble or tempted by those all you can eat breakfast buffets and bacon. Can we get some bacon in here? Glad no, I go back. I spent the day with ah! beverage, meditation, and six hours of yoga. Next I go open up the shop, now and then, and drink two pints of hand breath potato And who wants a steak after that? Okay, next caller, you are on Chatterbox with Reed Tugger. Yo, B, come to the movies are dope. How can I learn to beat up ten guys at once? Okay, first things first, my man. You need to stop the negative thinking. And the best attack I've found is to just run away. That way you can still fear in the movie. You never know when you're going to descend from the rafters. Like a bat! I don't want to hear about no tofu running away. I want to learn about these things. that? Actually, I do cover this early on in the book in chapter 45. It's called Stir Fry Your Prejudice. You see, I once thought that you were my master. Oh, no, no. 